Hi, Glenn and Lou. I'm on the 1500 block of South Wilmington Ave. Behind me is this smoke shop where the intense shootout took place, and it was all caught on a security camera, which authorities just released that video. Take a look at it while I tell you what happened. Just before 7 p.m. on April 3rd, four armed men walked into the smoke shop attempting to rob it. When one of them pointed their handgun at the employee, who was also the security guard with a bulletproof vest on, he pulled out his his gun, and that's when the gun battle began with the three other suspects firing shots as well. That employee was shot in the face and neck, but fortunately, he is okay. In the meantime, 30 minutes after the four men fled the store, one of them went to the Martin Luther King Hospital to get help with his gunshot wound. He ended up dying, according to the LA Times. LA County Sheriff's deputies connected that man to the smoke shop incident. Then they found and arrested a second suspect the next day on April 4th. Their names have not been released, but police are still on the hunt for the other two men involved. Take a look at their pictures. They've been identified as 23-year-old Kalel Lundy and 21-year-old Keith Rachel. They are on the run and wanted for murder. When you hear something like that happens, what's your reaction? Well, it's always sad when it happens in the community, you know what I mean, because we steadily look for change. You, you understand what I'm saying? So, yeah, but you just got to pray for the neighborhood because it could be anywhere. It's not just here. It's all over. Back out here live, I spoke with the man working inside the smoke shop. He did not want to go on camera or give a comment, but he did tell me that the security guard who was shot does not work there anymore. As for the two wanted suspects, if you have any information about their whereabouts, you're being asked to contact the sheriff's homicide department, and you can always remain anonymous through Crime Stoppers. Reporting live in Compton, I'm Courtney Friel, KTLA 5 News.